The first listing presentation that Phil and I ever went on, uh, Phil calls me and says, we forgot this client. He's looking to sell. Little did I know that he told me later that he found him on Kijiji. <laughs> so we went there together and we sat there and we had a great chat with this family about their property out towards Chatham. And quickly we realized that this guy was going to list with us. So we got out the paperwork. We, again, literally our first meeting ever together, our first listing presentation, yeah. we signed this guy up. And uh, and then we asked him, we says, how do you feel about this? And he says, well, he says, I put it on Kijiji as a joke. And so again, we asked him, how do you feel about this? He says, I feel really good. He says, you guys work really well together. How long have you been working together? <laughs> I One day. Think, uh, yeah, I don't know if we were 100% honest with them or not. I can't remember. Yeah. But again, it, it just really went together well. Mm -hmm. um, we did a great job for him. We found the perfect buyer for him. Mm -hmm. And I did tell Phil that it's not going to be this easy forever this, <laughs> to enjoy this one. But it was a, it was a really great experience and uh, everything's just grown from there. Yeah, that was a really good indication at the start that the, we were onto something. Yeah. 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 Bill and I have been working together now for over 12 years. And uh, it's been a great partnership. But we've 25 a, years if you count the times I babysat your kids. Well, there you go, that's so. true. But uh, actually working together 12 <laughs> years approximately. And uh, it's been a great partnership. Yeah, I think a lot of people would say in all kinds of relationships through life um, that you, I guess you balance one another, right? You each have your strengths. And that was something that, uh, you know, while I had some business experience through university and um, running my own business. Ron had something that I just didn't have and that was just a ton of contacts and uh, a really good reputation in the agricultural community. And the two of us putting those two kind of assets together uh, ended up with Farm Ontario. Yeah, I believe everybody on our team has the same goals, have the same values and morals that we do and uh, and that's important to us we don't work with people that uh, that don't have similar values that, because that's what we want that's what farm material is all about uh, initially it was a team of two as we mentioned with phil and i and, and even that was was great then about um five years into our journey um, we started adding good people to our team we went for administration first yes. uh, which was a huge help uh, just kept us on the road uh, and now we have a fantastic staff that just help us. So Katie and Rika help us with everything from marketing to paperwork to scheduling to meetings, keeping up with all the changes in regulations, um, just so much that they do for us. And then after that, we added Arian to the team. Uh, he started in kind of that Wellington, Perth County area uh, and farmed in southwestern Ontario for quite a while. Uh, before he actually made a big jump out to Eastern Ontario and um, that's how Farm Ontario East was was born. After Arin we added Teo Bless and uh, after Teo came Luke Bauman, after Luke came Corey MacArthur and, uh, and now Luke Bauman's son Brad Bauman is joining us as well and just the breadth of experience on the team uh, from different parts of agriculture is incredible. One thing that Farm Ontario would maybe share with farmers in general is this desire to build something that's long lasting, something that's maybe even generational, right? Um, Ron's son has his real estate license. You know, uh, my kids are still too young for that, but I would love the idea of uh, kind of bouncing around in a truck with them someday, you know, representing our clients out there working. Uh, we've got another agent coming on our team and his dad already works for us uh, in another area. And it's just beautiful to see and build something that's hopefully going to last for a really long time because this isn't, uh, isn't something we're uh, building for the short term, you know, uh, and then walking away from. We want to work with people a certain way, build relationships that are long lasting and build a reputation that's going to, you know, go on ahead of us for a long time.